Hi, this is Christina from Racing and Saving Fitness and today I want to talk about uh, the ultimate reset and where I'm at. So this is this video will be on day seven, eight, nine, um, which I'm currently on day nine. I first want to start talking about a little a few tips that have helped me get through the reset a little easier. Um, first of all I want to talk about the mineralize. You add ten uh, about 10 shakes to a glass full of water or you can do a quarter teaspoon per gallon um, the first day I tried this I normally drink my water room temperature so I had room temperature water waiting for me I poured this in and I it was not pleasant um, what I discovered was that if I keep the water really cold I put this in you can't even taste it really um, after a couple days I didn't notice the taste um, whether the water was cold or room temperature, but if it bothers you, try cold water. Um, the next thing I want to talk about is the alkalinize, alkalize if I'm saying that even remotely correctly. Um, this is the green kind of wheat grass that you take in the middle of the afternoon, and it says you can take it with two to four ounces of water. I find taking it two ounces of water much better because with four it doesn't really have a taste I don't know I guess it's just kind of the experience that gets a lot of people so if you do it with two ounces of water mix it really well because it can be clumpy so mix it really well two ounces of water um, and I haven't found a difference whether it's cold or room temperature um, it's not too bad and what I do is I like to do I just try to shoot it down as quick as possible that way less water makes a bitter group difference. Um, and then um, the other thing I want to talk about is, so that's, that's that, and you just get used to it. Like I said, it doesn't really have a taste. Some people say that they add a couple of lemon drops to it. Other people talk about that they take, you know, they'll have a slice of lemon and they'll take a bite of it right after shooting this down. So it's, I, I can do just water and drinking it as fast as possible. Um, I have started day eight, the detox week. Um, so you drink three of these per day. And there again, it doesn't have a lot of taste. It's, you drink it with a full glass of water. So what I do is I put my mineralizer in, take my other supplements if I have any to take with it, and then I throw this in there. And I just keep it spoon. It says to put it in there, wait a couple minutes, you know, put it in there, stir it around, wait a couple minutes, stir it again. I just keep the spoon with me and just I'll take a couple sips, stir, take a couple sips, stir. It's pretty full. The first day that I did this Monday, I, I, I drank it down. I got, I've gotten used to after the first week of drinking that much water, but drinking it with this in it seemed to make me really full for about 15 minutes. You know that feeling you get when you've eaten too much and you're just like, oh, uh, that's how I got for the first day every time I drank this. Um, for about 15 minutes and then I noticed it kind of subsided so it was good that I did this 30 minutes before meal because by the time the meal came I was ready to eat um, but it, it kind of has a, a fresh lemony taste almost to me so I haven't really minded it but like I said I just keep stirring it to keep it from getting too clumpy towards the end because it it's pretty heavy and it just kind of settles to the bottom hopefully you're not hearing my family in the background too badly the other thing and I kind of I admit, I'll admit, I rolled my eyes at this a little bit, this caddy. I'm a stay-at-home mom, so I thought, well, this won't possibly make any difference to me. But you don't stay at home every day, all day long. And I have found that every night, I refill this caddy with all the supplements I take during the day. Thanks, pumpkin. And then, um, and then, uh, sorry, my son was hitting the tripod. Um, and then that way, if I do have to run out, I just pick this up and take it, and it's no big deal. I don't have to worry about, oh, what supplements might I have to take um, later on the day. I just take it, and I don't worry. So those are some of my tips. Um, as for day seven through nine, like I said, I started the detox. I really haven't noticed a big difference. Um, there's no uncomfortable bathroom trips, not a whole lot of bathroom trips. Um, so that's been nice. Uh, nothing to worry about there if, if that's a concern of yours. Um, and the, the meals have been good. They've been, it seemed like, less 
there's a you know less of what you're eating it seems like to me um for example yesterday was just a fruit bowl and i know week three all more, every breakfast i think is fruit so it's a good in, introduce introduction into it also um you've taken out dairy and protein so um that's been a little hard for me because i really like my dairy i guess i really like my yogurts for snacks and things like that but i'm going to get used to it i guess um so I'm enjoying it. I am still sleeping like a rock. I went to bed last night. I was exhausted. I went to bed at 9.15, which is a little early even for me, and I was just gone to the world until I got up this morning to do yoga at 5.45. Um, so that has been wonderful. I'm still having almost no allergies, even though everything is pollinating outside, and um, it's just been a great life-changing experience for me. I've loved it. I'm down over three pounds, and I plan on staying on the maintenance packs that they send you after you complete the ultimate reset if you get the home direct and I just love it and I think it I really do think it's life-changing um, so if you have any questions please feel free to email me contact me my links will be down below and I will be ha happy happy to help you any way I can so have a good day bye